Good morning. You know, when you're driving up to Flicker Way, you might not realize why these homes are red tagged. There are three of them right in a row that have these notices. It's only when you kind of look up in the hillside and you can kind of see what's going on behind the homes. That's what the concern is. We have some video from SkyCal because last week when we had the rainstorm coming last Saturday and Sunday, that's when these hillsides started to give way. There was mud and boulders that came down into the backs of several properties and building and safety inspectors came out. They actually said that three of these homes were unsafe to live in. And so that is why there is so much concern now because that was just a week ago. There hasn't been time to remove any of that debris to really assess the damage. And now we are getting more rain when the hillsides are already saturated. We were out here yesterday, talked to a couple of people in this neighborhood, and there is a lot of concern about what could happen. Oh my God, you know, I felt so sorry for the owners uh, because I don't know if they'll have to tear down the houses. Uh, I don't know how much dirt has come down that hill. You know, you just always have to be prepared. Yeah. The weather can be so extreme. Now, fortunately, as we come back out here live, the rain right now has lightened up, but already in the time that we've been here this morning, we've seen periods of light rain and then it's gotten heavier. And again, because the ground is saturated, it might not take more for some movement. So everybody here kind of keeping an eye on the weather, keeping an eye on whether they might need to leave. The fortunate thing about the slides that we had last week is no one was injured. Fire officials are hoping that everyone will kind of be aware today and that they can make sure to get through this storm safely as well. We'll send it back to you. Hopefully so. Tina, thank you so much.